It's a killer disease rife in developing nations that claims 130,000 lives a year. Spread through waterways and contaminated food, cholera attacks the gut, causing debilitating diarrhoea. And now a genetically modified vaccine for the illness is about to be trialled in Australia. The cholera vaccine works by uh, introducing cholera to the patient who wants to be protected. A US company has applied to Australian authorities to trial a genetically modified cholera vaccine as part of a worldwide trial. A thousand adults and children will be given the vaccine as a drink, then monitored for an hour. The company is quick to reassure Australians won't be put at risk. There are measures that are put in place with any vaccine study to ensure that uh, there is safe handling of the product and we do not believe that there is any risk of this vaccine um, causing any additional issues in the environment. The vaccine has been genetically altered so it can't produce toxins or reproduce the cholera bacteria. But critics of genetically modified products are concerned that people in the trial will only be monitored for a short time. In the application it appears there is no follow-up monitoring or proper surveillance. And cholera is a very rare disease in Australia and there are no grounds for a mass vaccination project. Australia has been a long-term testing ground for numerous drugs and vaccines. There's a great set of research sites and world-renowned vaccine experts in Australia and therefore that was a, a reason for why we've come to Australia to do this study. Paxvax will recruit healthy adults aged between 18 and 45. There's no risk um, with the vaccine spreading here. Our sanitation and hygiene systems are so good that I'd be very comfortable with that sort of trial going on. Initially the vaccine will be given to people travelling to cholera affected areas then rolled out to developing countries. Sophie Scott, ABC News.